Alrighty, and how do y'all welcome back to House of Ash? Now, um, in today's episode, we are going to continue. Should be two more episodes ish of this story. Or two more, two more episodes. And we should be done. Okay, move group. If I think for one second you're trying to cross me, best believe me. Follow me second you're dead. I kill vampires. You think I'm afraid of a jar head? That looks like our best way through. One of us holds up the gate, the other can slip through. Find another way around. I think there's a way through. I just need to clear it from my side. Do it quick. Those things could be anywhere. Got any idea what we're dealing with? I think they're vampires. They're vampires. Not possible. My father once told me if something looks like shit and smells like shit, you don't have to taste it to know that it's shit. <laughs> Believe me, they're vampires. We must work together to defeat them. Yeah, it's beginning to look like that. Hello? Okay. What's the first thing you're gonna do when we get out of here? Hold my son. How about you? What'll you do? I'll probably just go for a drink. That's fair. Y'all can read this. Seem like you got your head screwed on. So I gotta ask, what the hell made you sign up with Saddam? For us, we had no choice. Your friend Nick, I like him. He was good to me. 
Circumstance. Any other day, he'd put one between your eyes. is the meaning of those markings on your hand? It's to honor the dead. It's the reason I fight. It's as good a reason as any. It's a mm -hmm. damn good reason. The only reason. I have no grievance with you. Maybe you need to switch on the news. <laughs> Listen. There was a man once who built his house on the banks of a river. When the floods came, his wall washed away. When the droughts came, the water dried up and the man was thirsty. All day, the insects bit this man's flesh. Yet each night, he says to his wife, we have all the fish we can eat. Your people chose this war, Jason. I think you need to give your mouth some rest. Uh oh. Right by the face. I say we get the fuck out of here. Mm hmm. Good deal. Looks to me like a medical bay. This could come in handy. If you want to stick 60 year old explosive in your bag, be my guest. <laughs> Facts. Those chemical weapons are close, right? Yep. Oops, I didn't hear what he said. Do you want to hear a joke?
those caverns. Whatever's down there, those explorers got there first. Now hold up, will you? What are you doing? You think they're still alive? That's hopeful. Hope is all we got left. Okay. You can know someone for years and never really know them. I have no idea my captain was married. That the asshole you were with earlier? You didn't make it. Works for me. Always <laughs> bad guy to deal with. A time will come when you'll deeply regret this manner. I don't carry regrets. There you go. Make of it. It's like nothing I've ever seen. You see that elevator cable? The explorers must have gone down. I don't think they made it back up. That winch still looks functional. No. No. No? We are not going down there. The archaeologists didn't make it out. What does that tell you? We're not archaeologists? <laughs> Our world is up there, not down below. Well, there's an army of monsters between us and the world above. They're close. Fire it up. You crazy? If those vampires come from anywhere it's down there, you really want to find them in their own home? What I've been doing since I set foot in this country. Get that elevator working. Where you get to work? Here we can. Oh no! An ancient horror has awoken from its slumber and is hungry for blood. Shall we see how many have fallen into shadow? Rachel found her way back to the lights. Mm -hmm. Well done. All a lie. Bet. Although don't get complacent, their lives still hang by a thread. 
Let's hope nothing unfortunate has befallen Sergeant K. Those taken by the abyss seldom live to tell the tale. Mm. As for Jason and Salim, sworn enemies, you cannot seem to bury the hatchet unless that hatchet is buried in a bag. I don't want to seem like an ungracious host, but time is against us. I'll be here to greet your charges as they cross the finishing line. Or to bury what remains of them under it. Hmm. Okay. They're in little hope. Heads up. Oh. It smells fried. We're in hillbilly territory. What were you expecting? Cantaloupe caviar. Not exactly honeymoon material, is it? <laughs> I recall a certain somebody saying that she wanted to go ice climbing. Ice climbing is relaxing what is it the guy who served me I, I don't know he was he was looking at me pretty strange yeah, he probably doesn't get to see a woman like you around these parts very often especially when we showered <laughs> uh, he was saying some weird shit such as it's nothing we should go no, come on, tell me. He said I'll never again be as happy as I am now. What the hell does that mean? You don't believe him, do you? Of course not. You know, my sole objective, Rach, is to make you happy. Doesn't matter where we are or what we're going through, I'll always put a smile on your face. See, I told you. Next time, all you have to do is whistle, and I'll come running to defend your honor. Oh, like my very own loyal puppy dog. Semper Fi. <laughs> he's always loyal. I'm more than capable of looking out for myself. Now get your feet off my dash, you hillbilly. Dang. Nick, I thought I lost you. I thought I'd lost you. Mm. Right. All yeah, right. Eric. Uh oh. Oh, I'm the one who put the mint. Put the mint. It's malfunctioning. Colonel, you gotta go. You too, Nick. You're coming with us. Come on, Ray. Shit. There. 
no, 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 no. Mm. Gotta help them. I mean, that's the only help. He's one of our own people, so. Eric! Don't drop him. Jesus. Pull me up. I mean, to me, that was the only option there. Like, you could. Like, if we just ran, Activator. Nick would have died. I mean, obviously. And that guy, he didn't seem very uh, worried about killing him. So, that's why. Mm -mm. Yeah, he's still alive, but don't know. Think that thing's gone? Looked like it went down that tunnel. He's alive. Jason's alive. Maybe things aren't going so badly after all. Back there, oh. Thanks for looking out for me. All right, let's find Kolchak. What are you waiting for? A written invitation? Let's go. It's time. It's absolutely not the time. You can't keep playing this, man. Nick, listen. No, 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 you listen. If I get killed down here, I want to know I stood up like a real man, not some chump. Rachel, you... You said you tell him when the time was right. I need you to tell him now. <laughs> tell him the truth. You don't wear a ring because your marriage ended a year ago. He's right. It is time. Roll it out for us. Now? Right fucking now? Yes. Right now. We may not have another chance. Fine. Eric. You and I, we had something very special, but that was a long time ago. Oh, uh, you're choosing him. We'll be loving. I still love you, Rach. This isn't about choosing. It's about knowing what's best for me. I want to start a new life. I can give you that. No, you can't. After we split, it took me a long time to find hope. Nick is hope. I can give you hope. I can make it work. You cut that rope and let me fall. Is that your idea of being my rock? <laughs> Dang. Let it go, man. All means nothing if we die down here. True. It means something to me. Let's find Kolchak. Gotta find him. We're about 30 minutes in now. I think we probably ought to stop here soon. Because... I've seen some fucked up shit in my life. Nothing comes close to this. They don't seem to be following. Do you like to wait for them, or...? 
Don't need to be a smart ass. Just move. So Hmm. I'm trying to think if we should stop here or continue. I think we had I think we had two hours left. Are we still recording? Yeah. We're about thirty minutes ish in here. So let's continue. Y'all can read this. Way back. What the hell was that? Okay. What is that? A cocoon? Looks like those things came from here. It's kind of like from died. So when did you become? They don't teach you American science at school. We should stay clear of it. Hodgson. Maybe he's got some intel that could help. I didn't help him. Ah, shit. It's empty. And so well, Jason. What? I can't end up like this. Oh, come on, put it back. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. I hate when it does this. This was all Lady Bradshaw's doing. She knew all along what was down here. She led us to them. I found her below, hunched over the murdered corpse of Van Hoyten. As she turned to face me, I saw that she had changed. My hand fell to the closest weapon I could find, an iron tent peg. I stabbed her with the metal impaling her in the heart. She died. Unholy screams echoed from deep below, as if answering the sudden release of blood. Okay. All right. Put that down.
You said. What the fuck is this place? I have no clue. We are being judged. God is punishing us all for the mistakes we've ever made. Zane is all I have left in this world. After my wife left us, I gave him my all. I wanted him to have everything I didn't. Single parent. It's a fucking gig. It is. But my boy has made me very proud. Mm. He's going to London, to university. If only he would stop stealing. <laughs> I miss him so much. Is your conscience clear, Jason? Green zone. Checkpoint. What checkpoint? Nick and I... We were caught in traffic. Checkpoint had been hit before by suicide bombers. Woman. She was carrying a bag. Fuck. Tell me. I ordered. I ordered for her to stop, loud and clear, but she didn't. She just kept on walking. I uh. I had to make a call. Nick. He shot her dead. What was in the bag? Groceries. <laughs> well. I don't understand. Why didn't she stop? She didn't hear me. She had fucking headphones on. This, this bullshit, I'm not here to honor the dead. Truth is, my life was going nowhere fast. I jumped at the chance to sign up. We all have our reasons. They don't have to be profound. <laughs> profound, huh? Those towers were hit. I was stoned out of my fucking skull. I didn't even hear about it till a week later. How's that for profound? I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing here. You're serving your country. That woman had a family, friends. She had her whole life in front of her. And we snuffed it out with a single bullet. I mean, what the fuck? I can hear you thinking. We're waiting for something to happen. Maybe we should take the initiative and make something happen. What do you have in mind? We go inside there and we find a way to hurt them. Those fucking things tried to fuck with our heads. They tried to kill us. But you and I, we're both standing. Start believing, Salim. 
We're gonna get out of here and see the sun again. Is that what you truly believe? Oorah! What on earth is that sound? <laughs> it's a marine thing. Oh. So, does that make me a marine too? Let's not get ahead of ourselves. <laughs> okay. Hey. Whatever happens out there, I got your back. We'll stand together. It's the only way. Okay. Well, pretty freaky place. First back search the area, so I'm gonna search it. This gotta be where those things come from. I think so. The question is, where the hell are they? There's like nothing to look around at. Like nothing. Do we need a drop down? Yeah, I think we do. Slay. Check this out. It's one of 
of those creatures, only older, ancient. You don't think it's alive, do you? Touch it. Don't touch it, you stupid. Touch it. Pussy. I wasn't going to touch it. Jet. No, I ain't touching it. <laughs> yeah. I'm not. No way I'm touching that. Oh, the king, dude. Holy shit. Or, uh, the soldier, dude. Look at him. Check out that armor. This guy's goddamn biblical. Holy oh, shit. Did, did, did you see that? I think he's still alive. Impossible in this place, everything's possible. Oh, shit. Fucker's been alive all this time, He's sitting here with half a head. Fluid it must have preserved his flesh, his brain. What should we do? We can't leave him like this. Well, shit. He's had enough time to get used to it. <laughs> Serious? Yeah, we had enough time to get used to it, exactly. The noise will attract the vampires. I'll do it. I think, uh, I need to start thinking about calling it quits. Here pretty soon. We only got like five minutes left of video time. Ten minutes left of five, ten minutes left of video time, so. For at the hour cut off. Probably gonna end up dying like a dead little hope. QTs probably gonna kill me or something. That's what I think that's what killed me in Little Hope was QTs. So that's probably what's gonna kill me here. Like I'm pretty sure. I mean all the characters are all the characters were alive in Little Hope to the last second. So that's why I'm worried. It 
sleep. What is it? I think we hit the mother load. Hmm, <laughs> look at them all. The egg. I feel like they're all gonna like quietly wake up and we're gonna have a ton of stuff to deal with. on one or whatever. That's good as After this little fight team learning car fit. up like the fucking cavalry I thought you were dead not my time girl you made it now crawling through that tunnel was a highly unpleasant experience good to see you again ma'am take my hand Cool. You're here, man. This place. What is this place? those things up and get the fuck out good makes plan. sense sergeant k <laughs> good plan got left so we got um eight clips of 556 fmj 340 mil high x rounds a couple of nine mil pistols four clips between them we'll make that work huh plus two phosphor rounds and 
one block of composition C4. That's gonna come in handy. What about the UV lamp? Took a knock, but I can fix it. Just need a minute. All in is not enough. We've also got this. Ah, it's old, unpredictable. We work with what we got. Now, fuses are shot, but we can use the C4 to detonate them. Let's just hope they still pack a punch. The vampires come from those cocoons. You saw how many there were in that vault? There could be thousands in there. Should we blow them up? Burn as many of those motherfuckers as we can and head for the surface. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Sergeant? Ooh, rah. I'm not gonna allow him to carry a pistol. We are way past that point now, ma'am. We stand together as one. Facts. Looks like our explorer friends are here too. We should search this place before we move out. There. Got it. Okay. Alrighty. We're in Kirkwood's right there. I will be seeing you, seeing y'all in the next episode. Bye-bye. And take care.